What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Joe. I'm back at you with another video. Okay, so, sorry that, first of all I want to say sorry that I haven't posted up in a few days. Um, I'm not, as, as you can see, I'm not in my natural element. I'm actually up visiting my sister right now uh, in Washington, D.C. And, um, so, I'm in Redskin territory. That's why I'm still sporting around my Cowboys hats and my shirts and stuff. But, uh, yeah. Um, so that's why I haven't been posted up in a few days. But I'm doing it right now just because I need to. Um, because a big thing happened. Now, as you guys know, the Cowboys don't really participate in free agency. Um, and it's mainly because a lot of people, a lot of, uh, a lot of experts say that you build a team in the draft, you build a dynasty in the draft, which is true. I mean, you get a lot of really good players in the draft and stuff, but when key players that are going in free agency, you need to you need to pick them up when you have the chance. You know what I mean? Like, for example, we could have gotten Indomitian Sue. Now, I know that he's kind of a troublemaker, but he still is an excellent pass rusher. He would have been great on our squad. Okay? But we didn't get him. Now... We did, however, get another guy. We didn't really, I think, pay for him that much. We got rid of Keith Smith. He was our fullback. And instead, we got, uh, we traded to the Raiders, and we got the Raiders fullback. I don't know how to pronounce his name correctly, so excuse me if I butcher this. I think it's like Olawale or something like that. Um, Olawale, Olawale, I don't know. We got, we got their fullback. Um, now this guy, uh, he went undrafted in 2012. And he spent time on our practice squad, and then the Raiders picked him up, and he spent the last the last six seasons with the Raiders. Um, now, as you guys also know, Raiders players are not necessarily the nicest of players. I guess you could say um, they're not the best teammates to have. They're very loyal to their team, however, but they like to cause trouble sometimes. Now that's not every Raiders player like Derek Carr, respectable guy, and uh, <coughs> excuse me. Um, and so, you know, it's always risky to pick up a Raiders player, um, but when they're good, I mean they're good. You know, we got rid of Keith Smith, and we needed a, we needed a guy to fill his shoes, and we didn't want to spend a draft pick. And my and it's just me speculating that what their thought process was. We didn't want to have to spend a draft pick to get a fullback when we can just get someone that's already there. And it's always nice to pick up veterans, especially that, that way you don't have to coach them, you don't have to teach them new things. They they have their own style and you know whatever. Um, so there's not really much to say about Olawale. Um, I know that he did win like fullback of the year I think one time, and uh, I mean he. Was, He's very good. You know, he's a he's a good fullback from what I can see. Um, I'm just worried that maybe he'll cause a little trouble. Um, you know, I'm worried that he'll that he won't be the best fit. You know, because Keith Smith was a really good fullback. You know, he blocked for Zeke a lot of times, and uh, you know, I feel like Olawale can fill his shoes, but we just won't know until the season starts. So, anyway. So that's all I wanted to say. I, um, I'm going to be posting a lot more. I'm actually in the process, as of right now, making a vlog for like this whole time I'm up here. Um, so be on the lookout for that. I'm going to post. I'm going to edit it together and post it when I get back. So, yep. Anyway, guys, uh, let me know what you guys think about us in the free agency. Let me know who you, who you guys think we're going to pick up in the draft. I think uh, we're going to spend our first draft pick, and I think we're going to get a wide receiver. Um, I, a lot of experts are saying that we're going to get Calvin Ridley uh, from Alabama, and I think that'll be a good fit for us because we need a wide receiver, let's face it. Our receivers right now are not doing as good. Um, so, yeah, let me know what you guys think about it. And, uh, yep, hope you have a wonderful day. God bless you all. Peace.